ya ya wa 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 ya 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 hey hey ya um um ya ya phone boost my dick touch the roof Yo, we gonna get into this video real quick. This article did us all today that has interested me. We are going to jump into this straight from IGN. Shouts out to IGN. Henry Cavill wants to play Gero in Netflix adaptation of The Witcher. Yo, Henry Cavill. I saw some snippets of this on Instagram. I'm feeling it. I can see it. I can see it. I believe he can physically pull off the look. Now, Geralt's voice and his accent, I'm not too sure, but I think he can pull off the look. They give him the scars, have Henry Cavill grow out his beard, grow out a goatee. They, he grow out his hair a bit. I think he can grow long hair just like Gero. They might, you know, put a wig on him, something, give him extensions or whatever. Whatever they need to do. Henry Cavill wants to play Gero in Netflix adaptation of The Witcher. Shouts out to Superman wanting to be Geralt of Rivia from The Witcher 3 series. Well... From the Witcher series. Witcher 1, Witcher 2, Witcher 3. I play Witcher 3. That was my favorite out of all the three. To be honest, I need to read the books. I need to read the books. But the games are amazing. An amazing piece of work. Witcher 3. Definitely a revolutionary game of its time. Henry Cavill wants to play Geralt in Netflix adaptation of The Witcher. By Daniel Krupa. Henry Cavill has told IGN that he'd be interested in the role of Geralt in Netflix's forthcoming adaptation of The Witcher, which I think they can pull off pretty well, depending on which monsters they use, depending. Maybe the Drowners, they can pull them off easily, you know, get people, put them in costumes and stuff. I think they can pull it off. Certain monsters, like maybe a Griffin, you know, depend on the CGI. But Netflix, you know, they've been pulling through with the CGI for their show. Cavill has been pretty open in the past about his love of Skyrim and the World of Warcraft. Famously, he ignored a call from Zack Snyder to tell him he'd won the role of Superman in 2013 Man of Steel because he's playing World of Warcraft. I remember that. So a recent junket for Mission Impossible follow IGN asked Cavill what he was busy playing these days. The Witcher 3. I just, I just replayed all the way through, said Cavill. Loved that game. Really good game. With that in mind... We asked if he'd be interested in the role of Geralt in Netflix adaptation. Absolutely. Yeah, that would be an amazing role. Cavill also went on to reveal his love of the source material. Andres Sapkowski's series of fantasy novels, so he read the books. The books are amazing. Cavill told us, the books are really, really good. The books I started reading, and they are well worth the read. The Witcher show had was announced back in May 2017 with Netflix ad adapting Sapkowski's series of the eight novels, which in turn inspired the hugely popular CD Projekt Red RPG game. Netflix appointed showrunner Lauren S. Hiswich, who has previously worked on The West Wing, Daredevil, and The Defenders. The series has recruited writers who have also worked on Lights and Netflix, Jessica Jones, and Amazon's A Take. Fuck. That worries me. The writers from the Netflix Marvel shows. <sighs> Fuck. <clears throat> but I've also worked on the likes of Netflix, Jessica Jones, and Amazon's to take. While we know the script for the pilot episode is finished, there has yet been no word on casting. 15 actors who can play Geralt. Uh, no. No black people should be playing Geralt. Ain't no race thing. The problem is... This takes place in a place in Europe. Polish is a Polish novel taking place in Europe where you're going to see a ton of white people. So, no. I don't think they should put make Geralt a black actor. Keep him European, white, Caucasian. Don't try switching up. Don't make Geralt no female saying, we're trying to do something different. No. 
Keith Gerald the way he is. A white male with long hair. I am not saying no black man can't do it. It's just that it'll be weird if he's the only black guy out of all of these white people. It's going to be weird. It is going to be weird. It's like putting making Gerald Asian and he's stuck in a pool of just white people in the series. Just white people and he's the only Asian. It's going to be weird. His Rich is currently scouting locations for the show, which is expected to be eight episodes long and released in 2020 at the earliest. All right, but most likely going to be hour-long episodes each, which I expect. If it's eight episodes, yep, CJ going to be on point then with these monsters, and they're definitely going to bring out the big guns. But they're going to focus more on story to narrative, and the monsters going to be sort of the side story to it. I don't know. What if they go the blood and route, the blood and wine route? What if they go off the expansion? Well, no, they said the books. I need to read the books. I'm not sure if that was even in the books. I don't know. They may involve Regis. Let's see these comics. Cabo is a man, period. He can do whatever he wants, and it'll be good. You do your thing, Soups. Better role than getting Jen Richmond. Ensign Mount. Looks just like that picture. First reaction is, hell no, but since he actually knows about the source material, that can help his chances. Yeah, you read the books. But it matters if he's going to defend... Like, hey, if they're deviating too far from the source material, is he going to get up there and be like, yo, no, 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 this is how it's supposed to go. I'm laying down the law. I read these books. I'm letting you know this is not right. Cavill, you better do that. Do not just let anything happen. Defend the story and make sure this is a true adaptation. Man, if he loves games and books, I agree. They are both fantastic that much. I sure as hell hope he lands it. The passion cannot come out in his book. That passion can't not come out in his performance. Why? Amen. Why? So Netflix can blow $300 million on cgi a mustache off too? Can't <laughs> That joke is over. Geralt is supposed to be somewhat handsome, lol. I mean, Henry Cavill was a handsome dude. Uh, no. He could make a cool villain. Maybe a noble type. He's an actor. Man, people doubting Henry Cavill. I think he can pull it off. He has the build, the, phys- the the physique. He's gonna be a little big, but you know, Gerald's kind of a skinny guy. I think he can. I think with this physique, it's okay. At least he's not a bodybuilder. At least he's not Dave Dave Bautista big. He's not like a big bodybuilder. So I think he can play. And he read the books. That's hope. That's hope. That gives me hope. For those who haven't played Witcher 3, go play that game. That's a very good game. Those who think it's some demonic, weird thing, no. it's If you like Game of Thrones and you want to jump into Witcher 3, you're going to have a hell of a lot of fun. You're going to get some vibes. You're going to get some vibes like, damn, they're playing, I'm playing Game of Thrones. It's going to be just like that. Trust me. Trust me. But look, we're going to end this video there. I believe... Nah, that was him. So just been Groot shoved that needle up inside Drax. But nah, we're going to end this video there. It's your boy, SJK, the first black Super Saiyan to arrive on this planet. Henry Cavill. I'm totally fine with you playing this. Shouts out to you. Um, But, you know, you guys have a good day. It's your boy, k first black Super Saiyan to arrive on this planet. Y'all have a really very, very, very good day. Don't do drugs. Go spread some peace, love, and positivity. Y'all have a good night. I need to go to sleep. I got to get up for work in the morning. You guys get some good rest in. I got to go. Deuces.